What's up guys, in this video we're going to talk about how to create the perfect swing plane for hitting a baseball. So why is it important to have a good swing plane when we're hitting a baseball? The importance of having a good swing plane is that because if we are on plane with that ball very early, we're going to have a better chance of making solid contact with that ball, even if our timing is off a little bit. If I'm swinging straight down to this ball, my point of contact has to be perfect timing wise. My, my bat is going to intersect the plane of that ball at a split second and I've got to be perfect. But if I get on plane with that ball early and I'm in the zone, in the zone, in the zone, in the zone, out of the zone, then I've got a lot better chance to make solid contact with this baseball. So that's why the swing plane is important. Now, how do we create the perfect swing plane? There's three things you want to think about when you're creating the perfect swing plane. Number one is you want to create an angle, okay? So when I say create an angle, that means I want to take my chest and tilt it over my toes, okay? This is me creating a body angle or an axis, if you will, to swing around. If I'm standing straight up and down and I swing this way, my swing is gonna be very level, okay? But if I create that body angle or that axis, now I'm able to swing around that axis and get on plane early and get through that ball well. So that's number one, create an axis. Number two is keep your axis because what I see a lot of guys do is they get the idea of creating an axis. They'll get here, they'll create an axis, but then when they go to swing, boom, they start to swing and they stand straight up and they finish their swing straight up. You don't want to do that. On a good swing, when you finish, you should be still tilted over. You should still have that axis even when you're done swinging. So you want to keep that axis the whole time. So create an angle, keep your angle, okay? And the last thing, the third tip, is to extend through that baseball. At contact, our perfect contact point is going to be power L, forearm in line with that bat, but once we get to that point and we're on plane with that ball, we want to extend through it. So we don't want to just keep spinning around our axis, right? We want to extend through that ball at contact. So once we get to contact, we're here at contact, boom. And then we want to extend through it and then finish that swing while we keep the angle that we've created in the beginning. Guys, if you like this video about how to create the perfect swing plane, you're going to love my swing plane secrets. It's an online training course where I break down everything that you need to know in order to create, maintain, and train the perfect swing plane. Because the swing plane is huge when it comes to baseball hitting. All right. Now just click the link. You're going to see a link on the, uh, on the page somewhere. If not, you can click the first link in the description. That'll shoot you over to a page where you can read more about swing plane secrets. Like I said, you're going to love it. So definitely check that out because it's on sale right now. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to share this video with your friends and uh, I will talk to you guys soon.